ChatGPT said, In the sunlit halls of ancient Alexandria, sometime around 300 BCE, a quiet figure in a flowing white robe bent over a wax tablet. His name was Euclid, and though little is known of his life, his legacy would shape the very foundation of mathematics for over 2,000 years. A philosopher and teacher under the reign of Ptolemy I, Euclid gathered around him a group of eager students, not in pursuit of wealth or conquest, but of certainty, of truths that would hold firm across ages and empires. Euclid's masterpiece was a slender work called Elements, composed of 13 books. With breathtaking clarity and logical precision, it organized all known geometry into a single, coherent system. Starting with just five simple postulates and a handful of definitions, he proved proposition after proposition, like a craftsman laying bricks for a temple of reason. Parallel lines, triangles, circles, the Pythagorean theorem, these were no longer scattered insights, but pearls on a single string of logic. Yet Elements was more than a textbook. It was a declaration of faith in the power of deduction. Where earlier mathematicians often relied on intuition or diagrams, Euclid insisted on rigour. There is no royal road to geometry, he reportedly told King Ptolemy after the monarch complained about the difficulty of the subject. For Euclid, truth was not subject to authority. It emerged only from method, clarity and proof. His influence extended far beyond his own time. For centuries, Elements was second only to the Bible in terms of publication and translation. Isaac Newton used Euclidean geometry to frame his laws of motion. Abraham Lincoln studied Elements to sharpen his legal mind. Even today, geometry classes across the world follow the structure Euclid devised in antiquity. Curiously, the man himself remains a shadow. No verified portrait survives, no personal letters, no vivid anecdotes beyond apocryphal tales. Some even doubted he existed at all. But in truth, Euclid did not seek fame. He sought understanding, and in that, he succeeded beyond measure. Through the ages, his name has stood as a quiet symbol of intellectual purity. While empires rose and fell, while science and philosophy evolved and fractured, elements remained a beacon of order. Euclid gave the world not just geometry, but a vision of what reason could achieve, where nothing is assumed without cause, and everything follows from what came before. In an age of noise, Euclid endures as a voice of clarity, 